We're here at the bins where you pay by the pound to get stuff to sell on the internet. Actually, you could just get it for yourself. Whatever you want to do here. But you still have to dig through it to get what you want. Anyways, ooh, we have a cart. A bunch of carts over there. Um, it is the end of the day. I have one hour before they close. And I'm actually kind of surprised it's as busy as it is. Usually it's like super cleared out by now. <sighs> Um, towards the end of the day, people are clearing out around three, four. Um, but I'm going to see what I can find in the last hour of the day. And it's a Thursday, which is kind of the poopiest day of the week, to be honest, at the bins. But we're going to, we're going to find the things anyway. We're going to do it. Let's go. All right. It looks like we have a decent amount of breakable bins, but I'm going to go straight to the back and see what I can find. Well, that's kind of fun. It was from TJ Maxx for 35 Oh my god, it's a whole Santa. He is decapitated. Yes, yeah, so it looks like there's a lot of breakables today, so let's see what we can find. That's left over. She's got a full cart. She has got a full cart. Okay. Uh, it's hard at the back because... Made in England. Mm, I don't know. The music is just... Loud. At the back. So, we're gonna do a little speedy mix speed. Oh. Um, I think there's... Still rotating bins, actually. They close in an hour-ish. And I think they're still doing some new bins. So, we can still catch some of the new new, but it'll probably be just clothing at this point. Rosetti. Which I mean, I like some clothing, so. I'm not opposed to that. Alright, what do we have? Jessica Simpson, which actually not bad, but gotta find them with in better condition. <clears throat> Got some West. Have some DVDs. DVDs and uh, movies. A little bit of electronics. Which I'm not super interested in. Okay. Let's keep it moving. Keep it going. We got lots to look through. Even though he's missing a leg. Oh my. Looks like something's broken. Oh yeah, this whole chunk. Well, obviously, and it's missing the hands. What is this? Ruby Road. Jackson. Featherweight. Made in USA. First, that shell of Kant into free air of I can. Oh. Oh. My wonderfully amazing number one papa. Oh, that makes me sad.
Burton and Burton. I like that. Just someone's picture. $2.99 a piece originally. Fishy plates. There's a ton of these pirates. The brown glass. Planter. Made in British Hong Kong. This is kind of pretty. RC Japan. It's kind of a pretty bow. Oh, we have a salt and pepper shaker. One fish. Where's your friend? have some of these. I don't know why I sold them. Yeah, I did sell them. Hmm, maybe I'll get those. in a second. Oh. This had a, like, I think a hanging squirrel. Oh, it was. Like, two little squirrels hung on it. Oh, but it broke. Mm. If breakables can survive the bins, it's Miraculous. What is that? NC 
video. Oh, tournament. Okay, let's keep going. Pretty broken. Houston Harvest. Yours and mine. Hold on, I'm gonna peel the sticker. It looks like it was at um, Salvation Army at some point. Mm, this is the mark. Homer Laughlin. Is this like a little massagey thing? I think it is. something has like a nice little imprint on the rim um, I'm gonna look this one up and I think I'll look this one up too right now and then I'll put them back so I don't want them right now um, but I will be back okay I grabbed these I cut the other bowl so I didn't put anything back quite yet I'm gonna look take this sticker off of this Poinsettia ribbon. Ooh, that's a lot of plates. They're kind of pretty though. What is this? Crown Ming. Ooh, a little big hair on my. Made in Poland. Okay, let's 
keep it there. Got lots of dishes so far, and they're very precariously sitting in my cart. Because that's how I like to go around the bin. Okay, we have a really big row of breakables, so I think I'll take a look at this one. See what we have. And the Austria. Studio hand painted ZS Bavaria. These are pretty. Let me get those. I'm really making my cart interesting. I think I have Metlock. Is that what this is? Yes, Vernon Wear by Metlock. I think I have some of those. Plate. of Massachusetts. Hmm. Signed Nagasaki. Nagasaki. Johnson Brothers. Zipper's broken. Also broken. Andrea by the deck. Individual plates. Spode. Penny Lane. That's pretty. I get that. Oh, that is adorable. Coffee. It's like a ton of like individual saucer plates. Ooh, 
Ooh, this is light. Fishing trip, woodland creatures. That is adorable. Oh, we got a squirrel. Oh, we'll close up. We're really getting precarious here with our cart. Like a little raccoon style. Petunia pickle bottom. Okay, let's see if we can look at this other side. Or if they're gonna take them, I don't know. We're gonna try. a lot of clear glass. Lots and lots of clear glass. Uh, let's go down here. Oh, so many fragile. Like a little bear. $9.99 at Goodwill. This is very crazy, but it's Gatesware. No markings on that one. made in USA. 
it is signed L. Spivy. Hmm, maybe. Maybe. The finest Gordon's oat cakes made in Scotland. I can find the other one in my oh there it is. I don't know the brand, but I'll double check. What 
are you? You are... Show yourself. Forever 21. Sardo. Okay, I need to look up the both the shoes actually, but I think I'm gonna go dig through a few clothes and see what we can find. I have to be in line. 30 minutes, so I still have a decent amount of time. So let's go look up some clothes. vintage Oshkosh, but other than that, Loft still has the tags, and it's super lightweight, so I might get that. DSG. This still has tags. Was thirty two ninety nine. She and Sky. They cleared out a lot of the furniture. We got a faux um, Gucci. coming like once a week like I would totally get this and I get a lot of other things that I usually don't get now but that's mostly because I come so often that I have the ability <clears throat> to be a, li a little bit more picky um, so some of the stuff is still really good it's just I don't have enough time to deal with it all so have to say no to a decent amount. Oh, there's a lot of stains on that. It's a loft. J. Crew extra large. Ooh, I can get that.
actually I think it was at the end of the night like they were closing um because that's when I could make it and I found a Chanel vintage Chanel button down and I think I sold that for 600 don't discount the end of the day Pima Cotton Seems kind of small for a large. Okay, let's go do this row over here. like scrubs or something. Cherokee. I think I saw this. I did see that. This? Pacific Crest Winter Sports. homemade dress milk and honey made in PRC <clears throat> prana sports bra she goes Styling Co. Target. State Warriors, 
What are you? Okay, I think I am ready. I have made it through all the bins that are at least out on the floor right now. I might go check out the furniture and show you what they have there. Then I'll be doing a quick little overview and I'll be back tomorrow probably. Not at 5 o'clock. I'll definitely maybe give myself like three hours to be able to dig around and not get all rushed. But, you know, some days that's just the way it is. But, let's see. <clears throat> Seven. Ooh. I like the drawer pulls on this. Look at those. 25 volts. I think highly of it. It needs um, a definite refinishing. Uh, 30. Okay, they think a lot of that too. This is three. We have some chairs, a very funky couch, seven, mm, three, each of these, three. There's two of those. All right, let's do a quick little recap of what we found today. And I will be heading out. Most of the stuff I got today was glass or breakable items. So it will be weighed in at 79 cents a pound. But I'm gonna find a place that's not like uber loud for music and I'll be back. Okay, here is what we found today. Some days you just got a you got a quick trip, you know. You can't be here lingering all day. Um, but today I found a J Crew kind of plaid button down top. Got to make sure all the buttons are here because I have a problem buying things and it's missing a button. Uh, but this is size extra large, good size. Uh, next is a Nuitegs loft top, size small. Uh, I think it was the Loft Outlet. Yeah, I think that's what those dots mean. Uh, Goodwill was selling it for $12.99. It's a cute top. And it's super lightweight, so... I'll pay pretty much nothing for it. Uh, shoes. I'm not sure if I'm getting these pairs, but this is... Podoline? It's like a leopard print patent shoe no idea i need to look them up so i'm not uber sure on those and then these are dune i feel i've picked up dune before and they're good but i'll double check double check on the dune um but those are the hard like this stuff will be at the price of 279 a pound and the rest pretty much i don't know if that, but we'll be at 79 cents a pound. Next, I have a, I don't know why I like this so much. It says, welcome family and friends. And it's Bosco Trans World, made in USA. They originally were selling it for $5 at um, Goodwill, but it will be glass price, so 79 cents a pound. And then I have a bunch of these bowls, a polo or a polo, I don't know. Porcelain by Nancy Calhoun, English Country Fruit. And I thought I had eight, but I think I have seven. Um, I'm gonna double check on those to make sure there's no chips or cracks or one is super terrible looking, but um, I think I have seven of those. Next, a really fun, pretty plate. Someone was selling it for $2 at maybe a garage sale, but it is M&Z Austria a really pretty hand-painted plate. Next, someone was also selling this for seven, which is kind of high, but it is Spode Penny Lane Sudbury Shade made in England. And it's like a little butterfly bowl. 
Next, another fun plate. Um, ZSNC Bavaria hand painted. They look kind of like forget me nots. I got that. I usually do not pick up, um, what are these called? Like character plates, but these are so cute. Look at this. Look at this cute squirrel. Springtime frolic. Woodland creatures. Adorable. Kaiser. He's just so cute. And then I got the raccoons. I don't know if I'll sell them as a set. Probably not, because maybe someone hates raccoons and loves squirrels. So I'll probably just sell them as is each one. Uh, next, I have a stack of four tattoo plates. Looks like there is some rub on the gold metallic. But not too bad. I think I looked it up and I think the brand does pretty well. Uh, next, I have sold these, not, but they didn't have, I don't think, a picture in the middle. But they're like little bronzy, made in England, butterfly picture things. Great description, I know. Next, a really fun, pretty rose bowl, RC Japan gotten that. Um, I'm gonna put this in my booth. Just another mug and I love you with a cute little pepper. I did not look this one up but it is ARP or ARP Plastics made in British Hong Kong. Just a little angel couple, angel brother sister. Um, and then another bronzy made in England plate with some a fruit, a fruit on it. I wish I would have been able, I actually should have um, done the front rows first because I do know that they pull those first. I just wasn't really thinking about it because then I would have been able to look at all of them instead of just get the back part, but that's okay. We still found decent stuff. And it shows you, even if you have to do a little speedy speed to the bins, you can still find some stuff here and there. So, not bad. Not bad at all. Alright, I'll be back again, because this, this is what I do. I'm here all the time. But if you could give this video a thumbs up, I would so appreciate it so much. It helps the algorithms in the YouTube world, and they help people find the video, and help people kind of be, what is it? Suggested. The video is suggested to other, a lot of different people if there's interaction with video. So I appreciate it so much. All my stuff is posted on eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari. And of course, you can email me at hellohandbagsyt at gmail.com if you're interested. But until next time, I'll be back at it. And I will see you then. Bye.